All right, so I know this group of dudes. They're funny, they're wacky, they're loyal, and to be honest, they're douchebags, but I love them. I love every single one of them. They're like brothers to me, but they aren't related to me. I spend every waking minute with them, but I've only known them for less than a year, and some for two years. So who is this group of dudes? They're my teammates. And make no mistake, I may joke around about them, but they mean the world to me on and off the field. We've had so many great times together, and I totally cherish them. And they will always be there to get a smile on top of my face or to get me through the day. But during my time at Colby Community College as a CCC student, I've had to work through the turmoil that my teammates, as well as myself, have suffered because of our identities as baseball players. In my opinion, the majority of people who live in Colby tend to dislike us because of their misconceptions about the baseball team's reputation. I've had many teammates fined and ticketed for unwarranted reasons. I've had teammates drug tested on false assumptions, and I've had teammates arrested for crimes they did not commit. I'm thankful that none of this has happened to me, well, at least the arrested and drug tested part. But it still doesn't change anything. It makes me so angry and insecure watching my closest friends being judged not by their character but by the reputation of other people who have played in the baseball program before us. I know I'm not perfect. I know that they are not perfect. But some of us are literally still kids. We make mistakes, but we are not criminals. We are not bad people, and we certainly are not here to ruin the town of Colby. What we are here to do is to play the game we love. And I only hope that the people in this town will somehow understand and accept that premise and also accept us for who we really are and not what a different group of kids once was. Thank you.